<sighs> and we are here to talk about the winner of the Mass Sing in New Zealand season. And um, I have to be honest, I'm not happy. I'm happy for her, but for me, personally, I was not happy with this character winning. Sorry. But anyway, this is your moment, girl. Let's see who you are. Who's behind the mask? Are we ready? The winner of to the Mass Sing in New Zealand. Yeah! Let's do it! Who is it? Holy Smith? Never heard of you, but anyway. Wow. <laughs> well, how, how was that finally to have the, the kid off? Congratulations, the winner of the Masked Singer for season two. Made it! Made it! Made you it. went as far as you could go. And How are you feeling? How are you hot. feeling, babe? Hot. <laughs> you are quite hot. Thank right? you. <laughs> um, oh, it's great. I'm excited. It's, it's, I've never won anything before. Oh, oh, my God. God. Well, I feel like you've won the hearts of all of New Zealand. Oh, my God. After that. And you may have won, like... You may have won like a Tui or two, like a few music yeah. awards. Oh, that was bad. Few of those, few well, of those. <laughs> Your voice is, and I feel like an absolute sausage that I didn't get it for so long, and James must feel humiliated. Oh, right I don't now. want to talk about it. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. But you so I guess she's an icon in New Zealand. Your voice, you yeah. started off the show with not many from Scribe, then you had some Les Mis, you did all these different varieties of music. Were you purposely trying to hide your voice? We were trying to mix it up a little Just, bit. Just, you know, <laughs> slightly iconic, but you yeah, can't been help around that, for right? a minute. <laughs> I feel like on the way into Sky City Theatre tonight for this show, a song was playing as I got out of my car in the car park, and I was like, that's Bedazzled Unicorn. <laughs> Yeah. Now, and a, a bit of a running theme through this season is a lot of our masked singers don't tell anyone they're doing it because they want to surprise them in the reveal. How many know that you're the unicorn? Uh, well, not really many. I was hoping to surprise my nieces. They're going to go nuts over this costume. I've got lots of small people and young humans who are, are, are unicorn obsessed right now. So um, I'm going to keep this and start doing birthday parties. <laughs> Oh, hi, you. I'll be like bigger than the Wiggles. We're gonna do this. It's gonna be epic. We've all had to pivot during the pandemic, you know. <laughs> An absolutely incredible talent to have as our winner for the Mass Singer season two. I think we all agree. Thank you so much for agreeing to be here and just gracing us with your talent. My pleasure. I think you got your new explorer outfit sorted. Exactly. As well. <laughs> <laughs> well what a ride, what a series, and what a crazy way to spend the past 11 weeks. <laughs> Here for the final performance of the series, Unmasked at Last, it is your winner, Holly Smith as Bedazzled Unicorn. Oh, well, congratulations to you. I guess. Holly Smith. I tried to read the clues.
and the season was over. I mean, the thing is that there's, I have to say, congratulations to Johanna Smith to winning the season as the Bedazzle Unicorn. However, this is not the winner to me. To me, this is not the winner. It feels like the Blue Penguin or the Gladiator Alligator was so robbed. Because to me, in the comments, people have said that they have saved her so many times. And she's been the bottom so many times. So the fact that she's won this season over several other cast characters who has been way better than her feels salty for me. I mean, I want to be happy for her, but for me, this is the wrong winner. This is the wrong winner for me. Personally, for who has been reacting to this now for 11 weeks, this feels like the wrong winner. I'm sorry to say that, but anyway, congratulations to you. But anyway, yeah, congratulations to you. Congratulations to you, Hall Smith, at the Bedazzle Unicorn. See ya.